everybody, this is a, a poem that I wrote for school and I'd like to read it to you. It's called A Friend in Deep. A Friend in Deep. This day was as boring as any could be. There was just Rebecca, our mother and me. Our mother and Rebecca were acting like grumps. And me, well I was just down in the dumps. This day was bad. It had to stop. So we took a walk to the local shop. I went for the pet shop, my favourite store. The animal noises hit me as I walked through the door. I looked around and what did I find? Animals of almost every kind. Puppies, kittens, fish and mice, birds as well and all things nice. Then I spied a forgotten isle. Now this was something that made me smile. I saw something on a forgotten shelf. It was a cage sitting all by itself. I pulled away some dirty old cloths that had been eaten little by moths. I smiled, for right there was a little rat. She just stayed still where she sat. I opened the cage and pulled her out. She just sat there, twitching her little snout. I giggled as she licked my nose. My skin she tickled with her tiny toes. I ran to find Mum. She had to see this rat who could soon be a friend for me. I found Mum and dragged her back to the shop and to the aisle which stored the bucket and mop. When I showed her what I had found, she stared, her mouth hanging almost to the ground. Finally she said, no, 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 you cannot have a rat. Now hurry, we must go. I pleaded and begged, and begged and pleaded. This little rat was just what I needed. Next I said, I need a friend. I'll do jobs, for her I'll tend. Then finally, after one last plea, my mother at last did agree. Yippee, I shouted, hip hip hooray. Boy, this had really changed my day. Now I am happy, my heart full of song. I had wanted a pet for ever so long. Me? Well, I have the very best mate. A rodent I truly appreciate. That's the end of the poem. Come on, Squeaky, you gotta say goodbye to everybody? Come on.